Hello everybody, my name is Markiplier and welcome back to another Three Scary Games. What? You expecting something? <laughs> anyway, this is Leftovers. Um... It was something about how you don't need to do uh, something, and then in... Hi. Boy, I need your help, please. Okay, why is the picture of Dad all obscured? Why is our TV just a white box? Okay, what do you need, Mom? Talk to Mom. Sorry, Mom. I cooked too much today. Can you be a deer, please, and give the leftovers away to our neighbors? Oh. Mar Mark, respond by nodding or shaking your head with the mouse. No. It's okay, dear. They're not gonna bite. You'll have to be a big boy one day and learn to take care of your mom, all right? Don't be like your dad. <sighs> all right. I put ten boxes of leftovers in the bag beside you. Pick it up for me. No. No! Okay, ten boxes. That's... You didn't just cook a little bit more, you cooked a whole lot more. I... I'm sorry for troubling you, dear, but Mummy's busy with dinner. I know I've taught you to never talk to strangers, but you're not gonna let me down, right? Okay, Ma. Good luck, dear. Why do I need luck, Ma? Ma! Mum! Mummy! What's gonna happen to me if I need luck? By the way, don't come back until you're done, okay? Okay, Ma! This is a drug drop, isn't it? My mom is a drug dealer. Not my real mom. Maybe. <laughs> my mom is not a drug dealer. Hey, neighbor. God, I remember doing this when I was, uh... Oh. Ah. Oh. Oh. Hello, you must be the little boy from next door. What brings you here? I don't know if that's your nose, or if that's your mouth, or if that's your mouth. Here you go. What's this? Oh, it's your mouth. Okay. Hmm, my favorite. Please give my thanks to your parents for me. By the way, have you been a good boy? No. Ha, ah, you silly boy. Sometimes being honest is not always a good thing. Well, good night now. Okay. Thanks. All right. Okay. Okay. Nine left. Knock, knock, knock. What do you want? What's wrong with your face? Food. This smells delicious. Do I need to pay? No. Haha, <laughs> what an idiot. Okay. What? What? Am I the idiot for not tricking you into paying for something that I- Okay. That makes sense. That's fine. I feel good about myself. I have not been a good boy, have I? Hi? Hello? Okay, you're a little close. Food? Your mom's leftovers? Nobody wants that. You ever gonna breathe out? Wait, are you the son of that beautiful chick from level nine? Yes. Mm, I'll say I'll be sure to savor this while it's still warm then. Okay. Man, what lovely neighbors. I just realized it sounds like someone's taking a shower. I should come back later. I realized like there's nine floors, which probably means that there's more than 10 people that could accept. So maybe I shouldn't give to certain people the food, but alas, here I am. Hi. <sighs> what do you want, kid? I'm busy. Food. Seriously? I guess this is somewhat tiring work. You know what? Just leave it outside the door. Thanks. Okay, you could just Take it. How do I... Oh. There you go, pal. Why'd you leave your door open? I want a little peek. 
Okay. I can't go on anymore. Mummy! Mummy! Dear, why are you home so early? Didn't I tell you not to come back until you're done? But... Sorry, dear. Mummy's really busy right now. I'm sure the neighbors aren't that much of a trouble, right? You can do it. Please go back out there and make Mummy proud. Okay, Mummy! You got it, Mummy! I could just give all of them to the old lady, I suppose. No, I can't. I gotta keep going. I'm not hearing the slurping sounds of people enjoying my mum's cooking. You'd think that it would be echoing down the hallways of pure bliss and enjoyment. Hello. Yeah, one time I had to do a fundraiser for school and I went door to door in an apartment complex and it was just the worst. I sold one thing. Hi. Oh. <laughs> well, aren't you an adorable one? What brings you here? Food. My, my, how thoughtful of you. You must be tired from walking up and down the stairs. How about you come in and rest for a while? No, I'm not gonna do that. Oh, maybe next time. Yeah, maybe never. Okay, bye forever. Looks like no one is home. Are you sure about that? Oh yeah, there was a person showering upstairs. All right, no one's home. I'll check back later. I remember specifically one person was in the shower and was so pissed off that they had to come to the door. I don't want to talk to her. She's just going to bully me like in school. Okay. Looks like no one is home. I guess no one is home. Oh, why is that open? Hello? Oh, 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 oh. What? Boy, are you seriously back again? Are you trying to make mummy upset? But mummy... Enough, boy. You probably did something you're not supposed to, right? Don't poke your nose into something that could get you in trouble. Don't be like your dad. Okay. Okay, ma. You got it, ma. Alright, so, lesson learned. I probably only have one more shot to deliver all the food, and I gotta be a good boy. I probably should have placed it before, uh... Before they... Got to the door. Okay, it was this floor. And it was that door. No one's home. Well, I definitely don't want to go to that one again. I've got four boxes of food and three flights of stairs left. Surely someone will want this food. Nope. Alrighty then. Puppy? Puppy? Puppy! Hello? Hi. Yeah, what do you want? I got food. Oh man, you caught me in the best timing possible. I almost decided to just eat this little... <sighs> Never mind, thank you. <sighs> we used to have a bag of food down there. But some schoolgirl kept trying to steal it. I guess she succeeded. <laughs> Goodbye. Could that schoolgirl be... My arch nemesis from school? I think that was all the way up in floor five. I don't think it was this one. I think this one's no one's home. Yeah, no one. Yeah, it was floor five, definitely. Hi. As much as I love hearing you bully me, you gotta give back the dog food or else this person's gonna eat their dog. And that's no good. Hi. Oh, wow. You're... This is a little cry boost. Because I see your ugly face, that's what makes me cry. Anyway, what are you doing here without your mummy and daddy? Is that food I smell? Give it to me! No. You had some nerves. Hand it over! Why do you always have to make things difficult for me? You think I'm the one stealing their food? Damn right I am, I've hidden it away. I gotta teach that man a lesson. His dog licked me the other day. How disgusting. Dog germs. Someone call an ambulance. Call the fire department. His dog will probably starve to death any time now. 
Don't think about ruining my plan. All right. Great. Maybe I should just give that guy another plate of food so his dog doesn't starve. Also, he could go buy more food. Oh, whatever. It's all fine. I got two plates left. And that's it. And somewhere there's some dog food. I don't know where, though. Hello. Hi. Oh, you have a knife. What, what are you doing here, boy? Food? Oh, it's fine, little one. I'm not hungry at all. How about a chat instead? No, thank you. Hopefully. Thank you. It's been a long time since I had a chat. You see, my wife just passed recently. So it gets pretty lonely after a while. Especially this place. It gets to you eventually. For example, it felt like it was only yesterday that I met my wife. At the same time, it felt like it was only yesterday that I found her lifeless body with a knife stuck in her throat. I'm gonna cut to the chase, boy. Tell me, do you think that it's wrong for an innocent person to get murdered? Yes. Do you think anger is normal when someone hurts our loved ones? Yes. Do you think murderers should be punished? Do you think I'm the murderer? Food? 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 You want food? Okay, yes. Then, if you found out your loved ones, for example, your mom is a murderer, do you think she should be punished? I mean, yeah. Technically. So honest. So innocent. It seems that all is not lost. Come in and rest for a bit. I insist. Okay. Don't worry about your mum. I'll get her. Oh, I guess I didn't do it right. I should have been more cheerful and chipper in this. I went with this like a little bitch baby approach. I should have just been like, thumbs up, man. What are you doing here, boy? Food. Hey, food. I'm not hungry. How about we chat instead? No, okay. Thank you, it's been a long time. My wife just passed. Pretty lonely after a while. Especially this place, it gets to you eventually. Feels like yesterday only, but at the same time, it was like it was only yesterday that I found her lifeless body with a knife stuck in her throat. I'm gonna cut to the chase, boy. Do you think it's wrong for an innocent person to get murdered? No. I see, the son of the devil is finally upon my- Ow. Oh. E. Ow. Maybe I'll just not go to that door. Maybe I'll just not, you know? Hey, is that dog food? Wow. I found the stolen dog food. No one is home. Hello. There's a kind of a stabby man upstairs. Hi, how you doing? Oh, hey. Is this the rumored tradition whenever a new neighbor moves in? Yes. Sure. Yes. Oh, food. Wow, yes! Sorry, I've never experienced this before. <laughs> What's this dish called? I don't know. I remember Dad's friend lives on level 7. Uh, sorry, I don't want to sound ungrateful, but it looks so slimy. Thanks, I guess. Wait, is that an eyeball? Oh, so me mom is indeed a murderer. I don't know what to do about that. Was it this floor that had the dog? No, it was down one more. I think it was down one. Actually, I think it was down even one more. I found your dog food. Please don't eat your paparino. Damn, it was down one more. You got back our food? Thank God. Just put the bag back. Uh. Crap, gotta go, kids. Thanks again. What happened? What? What? Alright, whatever. There you go. Oh. Well, what are you gonna do about it, nerd? Eh, Alright. You'll regret this. Will I? Did I? You mad that someone's not gonna have to eat their own dog? Well, something to be mad about. 
Alright. Hi. Are you my dad's friend? I can see why you're such good friends with my dad. Hi. Hey, you're the cute kid from level 9. What are you doing all alone at night? Food. You want food? Aw, oh, you cutie. You must be so tired. Oh, wow. Your mom really made this? I just have to know her recipe. Hi, Hillary. It's me, Laura. Yeah, your sweet little kid just handed it to me. Kenneth is a very lucky man to have you cook for him every day, huh? What do you mean, was? Ah, let me guess. He finally told you about us. <laughs> huh? What do you mean that's not what you meant? Bo? You psycho bitch. You better not move, kid. I need to go home to mummy. Uh... Oh, oh my god! Hi! Ree! This is for tricking me to eat that so-called le- Oh. Ow. Ouch. Ouch. Ow. I didn't know it was a chase. Well. Alright. Peekaboo. Uh-oh. Uh. Hi. Hello. Oh god, you're quick. Hi! No! <laughs> Oh, 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 hi. Hello, hi. Uh, e ah, okay, again with this, this, ah, uh, ow. Alright, so then this, uh, this girl is being an asshole. Hi, what's up? Can I get by? <laughs> Oopsies. Ha! What are you gonna do? Uh, why do you, wait, why do you, I just noticed your eyeballs are in your mouth. Why? Okay, you can, ooh, I'm going home. Mom! Mommy! Good job, dear. I'm very proud of you. Now go to your room and go to bed. Mommy got some leftover business to take care of. I liked it. I feel like the audio design could have used some extra love, but I liked it. Very creepy and off-putting. I'm not saying it was bad. I'm just saying it probably needed just a little more richness to it. But the simplicity did work. If that was a style choice, I'd take it back. It was totally fine, but I feel like it could have used a little more. But I like that. Very fun. Okay, moving on. This is SCP-847, which is actually an SCP I'm not familiar with. I can go look that up. SCP-847 is to be kept in a reinforced humanoid containment chamber. For the purpose of ongoing behavioral studies, the room is to be fully furnished with a bed, dresser, couch, table, chair, full-length mirror, sink, shower, and toilet. The floor of the chamber is to be constructed of one centimeter exposed beams of copper, which can be electrified remotely with to a minimum 50 kilovolts potential. A 50 centimeter squared safe zone at the rear right corner of the containment chamber is to remain free of the copper beams in the case of personnel inside containment chamber during disabling of ASCP-847. No meals are to be provided. All personnel posted to SCP-847 must be armed with a shock baton rated to 30 kilovolts or greater. Only... XY males identifying as such are to be assigned or permitted within a 50 meter radius of SCP-847. It's a human female mannequin! That's all I need to know about it. That's why there were all these mannequins in the main menu. Now it all makes sense. It's all coming together. Ooh. Oh, hi. How are you? Are you SCP-847? I am what you would call an XY male. Hi. I missed those other instructions that were hidden behind my face. Okay. Well, this is definitely going to go good for me. Sure. Oh. It's my favorite, descending down into a basement. Always a good time. Why am I here? Am I one of the personnel? I don't think I remember having a shock baton. Okay. I don't see any, any exposed copper wiring around here. Well, that's flooded. Awfully quiet. Well, uh, as much as I love walking down empty dark hallways, I would often like to know why. Hi. Do I need a generator? Am I crazy or am I hearing things? Just little things. 
off to the sides. By the way, though, YouTube, those are mannequins. Don't demonetize me, please. Well, this is always comforting, knowing that I have no idea why I'm here or what I'm doing. Was I supposed to do something with that generator? Probably. Oh. Again! What is that? Am I inside a store? I'm inside some kind of a store. So there probably was something. Oh, hang on. No. I'm clicking as hard as I can clip. Again. Why? Oh! <laughs> Someone's throwing a tantrum over there? What's the deal? What did I get? I missed it because I... I, uh, was distracted. But I got something. It was either a key to a door somewhere else, or... some useful item that's gonna help me in some other department. But that was easy to miss. So, great. Good. Again, I heard the thing. What is that? I don't like not knowing what's going on. Ah, it was a key. Okay, good. <laughs> Who's telling a funny joke over there? Hey, hold it for me. Hey, save some laughter for me. I like a good joke. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> Are you starting to cry because I'm approaching and you don't want to tell the joke anymore and you're sad that I won't get it? Why? Are you insulting my intelligence and my ability to get the jokes? Glug. Well, oh. Good. Good. I bet that probably activated some kind of a pump. Or I need to pay, uh, pull, press, turn. The big red wheel that I saw in the other room. Ah, oh, that's... That's lovely. That's good stuff. Uh-huh. You'd think that, uh... You'd think that a building like this might actually have good electricity and wouldn't need to rely on a generator. I did it. Oh! Uh, okay! Thanks for closing the door for me! How you doing? I am what you call an XY male. Oh. I'm sorry, did that offend you? Oh, I can't get out. I didn't want to anyway, I wanted to go down here. Oh, no, never mind. I can't. Why can't I? Oh, now I can. I am not an XY male! I am not an XY male! Hmm. Someone having a good time over here? Is that someone? Hey! Okay! That's fine. What do I see here? Abda Abda Tubsa Nufzix Fuma Kalukuk. I don't know. This is probably some kind of a puzzle. There's definitely a. Ah, I see. Okay. Well, this is going to take some doing. All right. Oh, thankfully, I think it's in the same order as that one. I see. There must be some kind of. Symbols. That's a symbol that I think was on the list. Uh. <laughs> hey! Howdy, neighbor. How you doing? Hey, good to see you. You having a good time over there? Good. Okay, so we do have symbols. We got, like, that cog wheel and... A cog and, like, a ribbon. I'm not seeing that on here. I see the cog, but... Oh, it's top. ZX. Okay. So, 17. And that's a swirly whirlpool 
which is AA11. So it's either 1117 or 1711. Yeah? Oh, it's six numbers. Okay. So there's one more here. Oh, there it is. Eyeball cog. Cogball. NF. Oh, there's one there too, but I... Oh, yeah, that's there too. That means there are four. Okay. So we had K, which is eight. NF. 92, 8, well that's too many numbers, 92, 8, 11, 17, that's one too many numbers. Oh no wait, one, two, it's, okay, right, so there are enough numbers, okay, let's just do a 19, 92, 17, 8, and 11, 92, 17, 8, 11, nope, okay, there must be something that tells me the order, ah, here we go, 1, 2, 3, Three. One, two. Hmm. I guess we could just try all the different combinations. Let's try 1, 2, 11, 17. 11, 17, 9, 2, 8, 17, 11, 8, 9, 2, 1, 2, 11, 8, 11, 8, 9, 2, 17, 8, 92, 17. Oh! Oh! I did it! I, I did it. I thought I would have got that by now, but turns out it was the very last one that I could brute force. Hey, what's going on, pal? Hey, what's going on, buddy? Okay. Oh. Uh, okay. A peekaboo. Oh, who wants to play peekaboo? Come on. Who wants to play? I know I do. But I don't. Who is that? Someone wants some peekaboo? I see you. I don't see anything. Please, I don't want to see anything. I'd rather see nothing, actually. I don't want to be blind! Ah! Don't blind me! Don't do it! Oh, okay. Those aren't my eyes. Oh, ow. Oh, ow. Ouch. Oh, beautiful. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh. I'm dead? I'm going towards the light. This is lovely. This is really lovely. I like it a lot. Hey, this ain't so bad. Uh, Eater, can you tell me what you are? Can you understand me? Oh, cool. Good. Great. How did you learn to do this? Do what? How old are you? That doesn't make any sense. Do you know who I am? You are that which calls itself a human. Your fellows refer to you as doctor. Thanks. Do you know what a doctor is? It is your word for one who has been taught and teaches in your own fashion, at least. Oh, so I'm not a medical doctor. I have a doctorate. Could you tell me what you are? I am a teacher. A doctor! Could you be more specific? I am the teacher. I am a purveyor of knowledge. I shall enlighten you. Okay, cool. Thank you. How do you enlighten people? I teach them. Okay, all right. We're going to be a little pedantic, are we? What do you teach? I teach all that I have learned. So it could just be two plus two. Could you explain what you mean by that? Okay. I do not wish to do that at the moment. May I ask you some more questions? I provide answers. Will enlightenment lead to my death? That's a good question. I do not call it death. It is the consequence of being inadequate. Fair. Can you teach me through talking to me? I wish to enlighten you. If you do not wish to be enlightened, I have no use for you. Okay. Hey, wait, I didn't say I didn't want to be enlightened. A uh, youches. You know, that was a little bit of a strange endeavor. I don't know why that happened, but apparently I have not been enlightened, so I'm just as stupid as I was when I entered this shop looking for a sale of some kind, I'm assuming, or to steal something. I'm back now. I'm bleeding now. I'm a mannequin now?
Oh, I guess I am a mannequin. Did that cause my enlightenment? You know, if I was going to die either way, I think I would have taken the enlightenment. Pretty cool. I hadn't even heard of that SCP. It was in the top thousand and I never even looked at it. Pretty cool. I like it. Moving on. This, well, hey, how you doing over there? This is the apartment. It's apparently an unfinished game with a quickly done ending. Uh-oh. Okay. Oh, hi. I've not heard from my brother for a few weeks now, and I start to worry a bit. I have decided to go visit him in his apartment to see if there's anything wrong. All right. Oh. Okay, let's see. My brother lives in apartment 24. If only I brought my glasses, I can't really read those numbers from here. Uh, 24. I hope it's not the flickering one. Here's 20. Knock, knock. Anybody seen my brother? This is dark. Well, it just ends there, so that's fine. Hello. Knock, knock. Anybody home? Alright. Either these doorways are small or I'm rather tall. Hello! Alright. I swear I know my numbers. I'm just checking if there's anything else. Bottle recycling. Right, this is it. Apartment 24. Oh, my camera's gone. Well, that's inconvenient. Lixian, put up a uh, artist rendition of my face. No need to animate the mouth or anything like that, unless you could do just a quick automated to my voice signal thing, waveform, whatnot, whatever. If that's too much work, abandon the process and never even remember that I asked to do it in the first place and berate me heavily. Insult me, you hello. At some point, my camera will come back. But for now, this is the way that we live. This is what we have. Hello. It's in the basement. Great. Coming from the trees. Well, which is it? These are two different things. Hello. Not my brother speaking. I said hello. <laughs> you laughing or crying? I'm gonna go with laughing. I'm an optimist. Hello. Alright. Well, brother, what lovely art you've chosen to decorate your house with. I think that's a light switch over here. Oh, the roots, roots everywhere. Okay, good. Why? Hold on. Hold on. Hold. Hold. My, now my camera is charging. For some reason, it, it was plugged in, but the bat, whatever, you don't care. Oh, I'm sorry, someone in the bathroom? I'm coming in! I'm coming in! All right, fine. Be that way. I'm not coming in there. Hello. All right. Something about roots, something about coming from... All right. Oh, I don't need to watch that. That'll rot my brain. Roots. All right. You telling me to remember my roots? Remember my brother? Is there something behind here? Oh, this must be the keys for the kitchen door. I didn't know the kitchen door could have its own key. There's something behind there. All right, let's see if my camera's back. Hello. All right, I'm back. Let's see how long it lasts. Probably not long. Hello. Right. Well, oh. You know, I don't need to go in there. I'm just gonna say I don't need to go in there. I don't need to. And I won't. And I shan't. And I shan't. Uh, let me guess, that was the kitchen door there. I just couldn't see anything inside of it. I don't have an inventory, do I? You know, this didn't seem like it had a lock. Oh, what am I, what am I hearing? Is there a light switch? I can't see anything. I, I don't know what that's about. Don't go down there. Down where? Was this the kitchen? Oh! I think that's 
a light switch. I'm going for it. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Is that a bone? <laughs> what was my brother cooking up? Smells delicious. Nice pizza. His door is locked. But why? I feel like there's something important here, but I'm not seeing it. Okay. What is that? The penis? Oh. Aha. Uh -huh. He's for the bedroom door. Great. What a secure house we have here. My brother was one for safety. Didn't seem to save him though. Brother! Are you there? Okay. There are no bedrooms here. Oh, it must have, like I said, I don't know why I keep going back when there's a door in there that I did not try. Of course. Of course. That's what I get for showing my face around here. Whoa! There is no need! Shush! I was looking at this weird baby trophy. Stop. Hmm, yes, this makes sense. Are those roots I see? Oh! Hmm. Good. Great. Well, any other keys? Root killer? Ah. Oh. Wow. Nice book. Um, can I burn you? No. Maybe I could, uh, get a... Get a, like, a can of hairspray and make a flamethrower. Uh, light this, heat up some food. What do I need the lighter for? It's light. That's what the lighter's for. Take this and this. Take this. All right, fine. You're not doing anything, which is okay. I get it. I understand. It's fine. Power went out. I think there's a utility room in the hallway outside. Uh, so this. Oh my God. Hi. Okay. Good thing I went in the closet. I'm gonna just go now. What was in here? You were in the bathroom. Oh God. Oh God. Oh. 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 Who's behind the curtain? Who? Who's behind the curtain? I'll burn it down. Oh. Hello! Ah! ah, that's what I thought, a hallucination. Caused by my brother's rampant growing of this new strain of weed. Very powerful. Alright, anyway, gotta go turn the power on and not run away screaming at the top of my lungs. Hi? Ah, uh, well, can't open that, so I guess I'm just screwed. Here. I should get the utility room key hanging from the lamp in the closet before I leave. Of course! That is a very specific hint! Good thing I knew that and noticed that! Good thing! Good thing. Oh! Oh, that is hard to see. He's for the utility room out in the hallway. Why did my brother have this? I don't know. Well, better mosey on my way. Oh, see you around, bro. I am out of here and never coming back. Hello. Utility. Utility. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Hey. Uh. What the hell is this? Yeah. N what the hell is this? Not what the hell was everything that was happening in my brother's apartment. That specifically. All right. Hello. Any root problems? Kind of reminds me of um, Darkwood, which I freaking loved. Wasn't too happy about how it ended, but whatever. The exit is blocked by these strange roots. How it ended for me, specifically. Not necessarily how it ended in general. Ah, there was a door here. In the darkness. That which controls power has no light. How ironic. Is that pizza? No. Is that a tampon?
Maybe. Uh, 24. Power on. Need to get back to the apartment. But why? You want some of this? You want a piece of me? Huh? Bitch! 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 Yeah, come on! Yeah! Well, I won. Pretty sure that was obvious. Okay, so apparently don't go charging at the giant root monster that's about to blow your brains out. I guess I won't do a final confrontation of epic proportions. Pits me against the villain. My last stand. The only one left. Yeah. No. I need to switch the breaker box. You're probably right. I'm trying to. Aha, I had to click it. Sometimes you have to click, sometimes you don't. So what do I do about you, pal? Oh, you know what? Uh, I'm gonna go back here. Nah. Nah. <laughs> ah! Oh my god! Oh! Okay, well that was apparently not the answer. Or maybe it was and I wasn't supposed to stand directly in front of the doorway where it could have come charged at me. Maybe that was <laughs> the thing. That got me good. I thought I had it. I thought I had it. Apparently I did not have it. Power's back on. Alright, let me try dodging it. All right, buddy. Come at me. Come at me. You can't. You can't. Oh, I twinkle toes over there. You think you can? Watch this. Whoosh. He still gets you. Turns out he still gets you. Maybe I do got to do the matador style. Kind of just like get to the room and then don't stand directly in front of the door where he could get me. Because his twinkle toes be twonkling. Come at me. Uh oh. Okay, I'm gonna stand right here. He can never get me. Whoa, what am I seeing? Woo! What? I can't see. I'm going. I'm just gonna run for it. I made it and I survived. I'm fine. Get back to this apartment, definitely. This is where I need to go. I would be tearing those roots down with my bare hands. Okay. I'm back home now. This is pretty well made. I'm, I'm really happy with this. I don't know why I didn't get finished. Oh. Seems to be a few more roots than there once were. Ah. Fun. Oh. Ah. Oh. Oh, ah, TV, you're going to turn on, you're going to turn on, you're going to turn on, you're going to turn on. Didn't think so. All right. Love going in a basement. What did I just hear? What was that? What is this? Where's my lighter? I'm going for it. Hi. Are you the great spirit of the tree that lurks below my brother's apartment? Oh my god, what is this? This is where it all comes from. Hey bro, is that you trapped in there? I should really get out of here and get some help. Oh yeah, now. Now I would agree with you. I I do agree. Uh, Alright. Uh, oh. 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 Oh god. 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 Not now. Oh, hey, you come right at me! I probably have to ring around the rosy. Oh, no, I just had to die. All right. I like that. I like the style. Really did a lot with the sound. And also just like the whole tree and root thing, I think is an often overlooked horror element. It's very nice. I love it. Like, Darkwood really embraced that with, the, like, the natural horror of the trees. It's really fun stuff. But I like that a lot. Very good.
for an unfinished thing felt pretty finished to me. That'll do it for this episode of Three Scary Games. Thank you everybody so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Check out more scary games that I've played linked in the description. Many more spooks waiting for you. And as always, I will see you in the next video. What are you expecting, a jump scare? What's wrong with you? Bye-bye!